I'm deliberately recording this without a plugged in USB microphone, just using the microphone from my computer for a reason. You're probably aware that I can get Word to read a document to me, so if I'm a student who struggles with reading, I can at least listen to what the teacher wants me to do. I've got a little icon up here that says speak text, so when I highlight some text, I can play that. And it, it just read that for me. It read it in a horrible voice, but if it's the difference between being able to follow what the teacher wants me to do or not, it's handy. To do that, you just simply go File Options, and then in the Quick Access Toolbar, under All Commands, I'm going to look for an option that begins with the letter S. So I just hit the letter S then, and it's called Speak. And you can see here, here it is here. And because I've clicked Add, it's added it over here. And that means it places it up here in the Quick Options toolbar. If I highlight a paragraph, I can play it Video provides a power and stop it. And I can change the speed in the control panel settings. As I say, you probably knew that. What I've only just learnt is that in Google Drive, if I was to make a new Google Doc, so that's like a Word document in Google. There's a new feature that was introduced earlier this year. I've only just found out about it. Under the Tools menu, there's Voice Typing. So when I click here, and remember I said I'm doing this without a decent microphone, this is just straight into my computer without any training or anything like that. Google Docs will now type everything I say, full stop new paragraph. This would be really handy for those students who struggle to type exclamation mark. That's interesting because it got it right the first time and then self-corrected. Full stop. New paragraph. I suppose I'm speaking a little bit fast for the computer. Full stop. So you get the general idea. Might be something you want to explore.